What is going on, Puck Nation, and welcome back to another Patreon video. This is October for Lambo Mods. Today we got some, we got one mod that's been really worked on, which I am super glad. We have a legit car hauler. We got some bumper cars, the Dodge B, which is running. We got the Nissan truck, and uh, we have the snowmobile from 17. I'll definitely have to do some snow videos with all this stuff. Like, the Nissan has the crawlers. So the cool feature about the snowmobile, the 19, is you can strap it down on a trailer. So that's why I got the truck and trailer sitting there. You guys know that stuff. It's public. Go watch those videos if you already haven't. I pretty much do mod spotlights on every cool mod, or at least 99% of the mods in the community. I try to hit them all. So, when I first started in FS15, that was a challenge, and now not so many people releasing. I'm actually way ahead of schedule with all these mod spotlights. So, it does kind of suck. Yeah, with all these track vehicles, we can definitely do some winter uh, videos. So, I just want to say. Um, I didn't really like the results that we did on the community tab. I understand maybe some people are busy and stuff, so I'm not going to take it too much to heart, but I am definitely disappointed that the majority of votes said no. Maybe I should have put maybe. I don't know, but I'm just going to wait, I guess, until I get my new internet service, which if you don't know, it's MetroNet. They have to basically put all the new lines up. They have to build their whole infrastructure here in my town. They cannot use any existing cables now, obviously they're putting fiber in which our other cable service is completely garbage I'm sure you guys heard me that several times say that on live streams and other videos so don't think I really need to explain myself but that company is gonna be in a world of hurt because everybody's gonna switch to this new company their prices are unbelievable gigabyte service is only like 70 bucks a month while the other competitor over there is like $200 after 36 months of owning it, which is ridiculous. So. Hmm. That's weird. 19 miles per hour. What's wrong with this vehicle? Eh, these are all betas, so we're definitely testing them out. Yeah, that's really weird. We'll definitely get that fixed. For sure. Alright, so we need to buy some cars to go on this thing. And a lot of stuff you're seeing here, all these um, slim stuff, this was all from that Take Notes uh, release file that he released. So, so, any of that stuff you see, but we're going to use most of them anyways. Oops, I keep having them over in the middle of the street. <laughs> Alright guys, we're back. Let's get this stuff done. I had to do something real quick. People don't realize that I record as soon as I wake up and do my job and then I have fun the rest of the day. But what I'll do is I'll leave the master link down in the description below for a lot of these take notes, uh, edit mods. They're obviously edited, so... The original creators are down in their creator box still. I don't want to hear any of that garbage anymore. I don't know what Brooke Toys was talking about, but, you know, people need to stop being retarded, you know. 
It's where this community has gone to. If you release something publicly, your credits are still within the description of your mod. That's what I've learned. That's what people have told me. And trust me, it wasn't pretty when they told me. So I'm telling everybody else. God damn, these vehicles are low. Should have put the air ride suspension. It's not like Expandable's modding made that too. So there's that one. I don't think you could fit anything underneath. And then you saw me when we were loading it up on the truck. I didn't. The ramps didn't want to work. So hopefully the ramps do work. And then the top ramp does come down. Let's see if we got something different here. the crap and I gotta say guys do not ever pay for uh, edits these take notes edits are like garbage they have so many errors I just ran into like the biggest brick wall I've ever made so he doesn't look over his stuff he just makes the edits and throws them up so do not pay for edits only pay for patreon stuff Look at this, the collisions are definitely off on this car. So you can go in there, the ramps actually work this time. This is kind of a sucky ass car to use. And then we have some, I guess we'll keep going. We got some bumper cars. Very nice, they actually have flashing lights. So we reviewed that. Let's look at the semi. Last thing with the fuel trailer. Very nice. Well, that's going to be it for today's video, guys. Um, I do want to say, um, if you're looking for any of Lambo Mods, public mods, it's all on Patreon. It's public mods to the mods that you got to pay for. And then everything is posted 30 days after beta testing. So just look 30 days after. Like that truck will probably be up in 30 days. Hopefully this thing. This thing has gone through a little bit of work. So that's why it wasn't released back in. I think. I don't remember. I think I did it in July. So it should have been released in August. But I found the errors. And found the stuff that didn't work. So it's going through another beta testing you guys have to understand, a lot of these mods have to go through beta testing, and then the post will get public. So just keep an eye on Lambo mods. You don't need to ask questions. Just keep an eye on Lambo mods. It's like Facebook. Let's, let's start being legit here and actually researching this stuff by ourselves and seeing this stuff as public. If you can't honestly find something, then ask the question. We'll see you guys.